Hey YouTube, recently we installed an electric stove in our kitchen, which had uh, already wired for three wire, three prong, 220 volts system. Unfortunately, our system uses a four wire, four prong, 220 volt system. I consulted with a electrician, licensed electrician friend of mine and he walked me through the procedure on how to correct this problem. Now let me say this, do not do this project if you do not feel comfortable or have the knowledge to work with, with electronics. This voltage will kill you. Don't follow some idiot on YouTube because he did it this way. This is how I did it. You may not be able to do it that way in your situation. You may not be able to because of the local code. Check with your code, check with your local electrician, do what you feel comfortable with. This is how I did it. Okay, for the interest of time, I already took off the, t uh, the wire tensioner that holds on the bottom of the cable and the protective cover that covers the, the leads. As you can see with the three prong, three wire cable, you have your red and your black your power and you have your neutral which is also tied into the ground the difference I found between the three prong and the four prong or four wire cable is your neutral and your ground are separate and they're not connected so I'm going to undo these I'm going to take off this piece I'm going to connect the four prong wire and I'll be right back Okay, there it is. Got the neutral tied into the neutral, ground tied into the ground screw. Red on the red, black on black, and I took out the piece that was connecting the neutral on the ground for the pre -pro, uh, three wire system. I'm gonna close this up. Got the tension, the wire tensioner already in place. That's important because that way it pulls on the body, not on the connections. I'm going to close this up and see how it works. Well, Murphy's Law. Just got the stove installed and the dryer went out. I had to go get another dryer. But uh, the plug for this one is a three prong, three wire. Let me show you what the plug looks like. Like this. And it's a simple. you black, you red and your white, your neutral to put on there which I haven't put on there and I still have to put on the tensioning clamp but if it was a four, uh, four uh, prong or four wire one all I'd have to do is take off the internal ground circuit wire here that connects internally and I'll connect my fourth my ground to this this screw right here that would be the only difference. But thanks for watching. Kitchen uses a four wire system for its plug. Now, da. Hey YouTube. Let's start over again. Hey YouTube, recently we installed a 220 new. Uh, hey YouTube, stove. Hey, welcome to our kitchen. Da, da, de. We rewired the plug. I am not getting this. I am not getting this at all. Hey YouTube, not as a fly in here. Hey YouTube, recently we put a new stove in our kitchen. The stove was already wired. Excuse the trap. Had to fly. It's gonna be a lot of editing on this little simple video because I can't speak. <laughs>